We are in Midland, which is home to Messiah Lutheran Church, which has a long history of borrowing from CEF. They built their current worship facility with the help of a CEF loan, and now they're embarking on several unique efforts to reach to their community. Messiah is well known for looking outward and impacting their community. This is just the latest example. In 2022, Messiah purchased a retail strip center with the help of a CEF loan. They'll use this new facility to promote existing ministries, including their food ministry, The Bridge. Why don't we check out the retail center now, and we'll hear from Pastor Ed Dorner. You were standing here at the location for the new bridge, and it's a grocery store. Uh, it's for the community. Uh, it's volunteer run. Everything is five cents over what we pay for, so it's a tremendous benefit for the community. Our customer base is the Alice population. Uh, which is an acronym, Asset Limited, Income Constrained, Employed. That's primarily on this side of town, not by the mall. So for us to be able to find a building on this side of town, on Saginaw Road, great visibility, uh, totally a God thing. Well, the whole building is 16,000 square feet that we have, so probably about 10,000 square feet for this section. Um, we're going to go from, well, we have 3,000 square feet now, but probably 2,000 retail, so we're going to go up about five times. So we're about 40% of retail at the bridge. So see, this is where when we talk about standing in the gap, it's either free or retail. The bridge stands in the gap and says, how about we make it affordable? Charge something, and then you can give a lot away. We are in the people business. We build relationships. We have the opportunity to pray with people. We listen to people. We take a card out with someone and sometimes stand out in the parking lot for 20 minutes because they just want to talk. Grab your car. You can pick. Uh, you can pick brand names. And everything is essentially priced at five, a nickel over. Five yeah. cents over. That five cents covers the debit and credit card fees. We'll buy, you know, like this week I said, we bought 160 pounds of burger, but we vacuum seal it into a manageable size, right? So you get a great price, but you don't have to manage 20 pounds of burger on your own. They can come in and choose what they want. Um, it's dignity, which is what we were based on, and affordability. So those are the values of the bridge, and we live them every day here. I'm grateful for Church Extension Fund is that you're willing to go, you know, the extra mile, the extra risk, the extra... Sounds like a good idea. It might work, it might not work. Um, but if it reaches one more person and one person's eternity is changed, I think it's worth any dollar amount. We don't measure like, oh, if you come to the grocery store, or you're gonna to come to church, right? When you start something like the bridge, the relationships you get to develop with other churches, um, with community people, with the volunteers, with the people that come and shop here, um, it's so far reaching. It's really, I think this is the church, seven days a week. Thank you for making a dream possible. We have a lot of dreams and we're not done. And we have greater dreams, bigger dreams. Um, I'll be back, you can count on it. I'll be knocking and saying, oh Jim, we have another project for you. I'm really appreciative. I, I think if there's any message I could say, is just thank you. 